good morning students uh, last class we will discuss uh, basic principle of a shield metal arc welding process uh, what is the purpose of flux uh, why we remove slag after complete the process so these are the things we have discussed in the previous classes in this class uh, how to conduct how to join the two metals with the support of shield metal arc welding process so here we taken the two mild steel metal approximately length 100 mm and width 50 mm uh, with the support of a flux coated electrode so so initially uh, use the tack weld the two objects are joined temporarily so reason to to maintain that uh, proper alignment so now have to move in line with the direction so there is no deviations occur during that uh, uh, process how to avoid that one uh, initially have to put it to points uh, the support of uh, electrode is uh, name is called as uh, so now the tag holder is over now we do that uh, process a uh, continuous welder between the uh, two plates So here, uh, arc is produced uh, between the electrode and that uh, plate. So this zone is called as a weld pool or puddle. So the flux uh, to produce that uh, shielding gas to protect from that environment. So in this reason, uh, flux is covered uh, through that uh, solid wire. So flux coated solid wear used in the particular shield metal arc welding process. Now the process was over in one side, so uh, this slag is uh, called as a player bead. So once the process was over, immediately have to remove that uh, slag. Uh, it's a uh, temporary to the flux is uh, converted into the uh, slag. During that process, is uh, produce that gas to save that uh, weld zone. So once the process is over, you have to immediately have to remove that slag. Suppose if slag is not properly to remove, slag is stored inside that uh, weld place, the weld portion or location. It considers a slag inclusion. It's uh, one of the defects. So this is that look like that uh, spatter. You have to use that uh, optimum uh, current and voltage. You have to avoid that one. Then you have to move that uh, travel. Uh, welder have to move the travel the support of holder so properly have to move have to avoid uh, 
these types of uh, issues to produce that uh, welded surfaces in that area. So this is that uh, electrode, I have to use that uh, flat position. So this uh, type of uh, process is suitable for all welding positions, a uh, flat horizontal vertical overhead. This is that uh, big advantages of uh, uh, shield metal arc welding process. These types of uh, facilities are advantages, not uh, for the some other process. It's a big advantage of the particular process. When we start the process, we are not take that uh, weak group uh, because uh, it's a very thin metal. If we go 10 mm thickness or 12 mm thickness, uh, should take that uh, weak group. So at that time, uh, only one side is possible to do that welding process if the metal is uh, sufficient to penetrate. So here we have to conduct both the sides uh, did that uh, welding. So this is that uh, surface. Already I said it's called as a bead. This is the test pattern. So now only the process was over. So immediately have to remove that particular slab. With the support of wire brush, you have to remove that uh, slide. 